What's going on guys? It's your boy Bo, back in it again with a predictions video for the Lakers v Denver Nuggets in the Western Conference Finals winner, the winner goes to the NBA Finals and this I'm actually surprised, everyone's shocked that the Denver, it's going to be the Lakers v Denver Nuggets everyone was thinking, oh yeah it's going to be the Lakers v LA Clippers but nah, it's the Denver Nuggets because the Clippers <coughs> Choked, as we all know, we're up 3-1 against the Nuggets, and the Nuggets came back and won it. But I've wrote some stats down through the regular season that we played the Denver Nuggets four times. Lakers won the series with 3-1. Everyone's a bit nervous about that here in 3-1. You lead in the series 3-1 against the Nuggets because the Nuggets have came back twice when they're down 3-1 and have done it in the playoffs this season. But I'm not too worried about it, but this is just the regular season, not the playoffs. But anyway, so Lakers won the series 3-1, as I said. Game 1 of the regular season, Lakers won 105 to 96. LeBron, I'm just going to do stats off the two superstars from each team. LeBron had 25, 9 assists and 6 rebounds. Anthony Davis, 25 points, 1 assist and 10 rebounds. Murray, 25 points, 5 assists, 5 rebounds. Jokic, Jokic, 13 points, 8 assists, and 8 rebounds. Game 2 of the regular season. The Nuggets won this one, but we are, the Lakers only had one superstar playing with Anthony Davis. LeBron James didn't decide to play, decided to have some low management, as Chris Moon would say. So Anthony Davis, dominant performance, 32 points, 1 assist, and 11 rebounds. Murray did not turn up. 6 points. Five rebounds and three assists. He did not have a great game. Jokic, 18 points, five assists and six rebounds. Game three of the regular season. Lakers won 120 to 116 in overtime. LeBron James, 32 points, 14 rebounds and uh, not four, 14 assists and 12 rebounds. Dominant performance. Emily Davis with another with a predominant performance with 32 points, 2 assists, and 10 rebounds. With Murray, with 32 points, Murray decided he was going to turn up in this game. With 32 points, 10 assists, and 3 rebounds. And Jokic, 22 points, 6 rebounds, uh, six assists, and 11 rebounds. And a game, the last game of the regular season that was in the bubble, Lakers got the game winner with Kyle Kuzma. But LeBron James had 29 points, 12 assists, and 1 rebound. Anthony Davis had 25 points, 5 assists, and 6 rebounds. Murray had 14 points, 3 rebounds, and 4 rebounds. Uh, 3 assists, 4 rebounds. I keep saying. Sorry about this. Um, Jokic had 12 points, 4 assists, and 1 rebound. 1 rebound, Jokic. And you're a center. 1 rebound. But anyways, sometimes Murray and Joke Anthony Davis usually has his way against Jokic, it seems like, with the stats. But I know Anthony Davis isn't the centre, but he most likely will play centre and he will play on Jokic. But I'm not going to say. So Anthony Davis will probably have his way with Jokic. But it's different. They're different in the playoffs. Different playoffs are a lot different than the regular season. We all know that. So, Jokic might be a bit different, he might turn up. Murray, we know how he's going to probably go. He's probably going to have good games. Really good games, most likely. Because he's been going off, as we saw yesterday, one of the best Game 7 performance. 40 points. No, he wasn't missing shots, he was hitting anything he threw up. That guy was unreal. He was the reason why the Nuggets really won. But my prediction of... Who I got winning the series, of course, I am a Lakers supporter, as we all know. But I got the Lakers in five games. I know if you can five games, you're playing against the Nuggets. It should be like six or seven, the get series. But I've got five. The reason why I got five is because LeBron James and Anthony Davis. Mainly. They are going to dominate, and most likely... LeBron will be guarding Murray if he decides to go off. And LeBron James, he's not known, he's not as good as he used to be at defense, but he knows how to stop people. Uh, he knows how to, like, stop someone. He's been playing some good defense this year, I'll tell you that. Probably with the help of Anthony Davis, Dave, Anthony Davis getting up his ass, telling 
you got to play defense, bro. you got to play some defense. And if you saw when we played against the Clippers in the first game of the bubble, see look at Kawhi Leonard's face? Kawhi Leonard's face, he was like, ugh! Because LeBron James is guarding him. Literally, LeBron has been a good defender this year. I'll give him credit, he's been a good defender. Sometimes he does have that lazy like, defensive play where the player just gets past him. He's just like, yeah, stuff, yeah. But that's all good, it's all good. I do have the Lakers winning this series, and then we go into the NBA Finals. What it would be good, as you're showing you, I've got the sick ass Lakers shorts. Freaking mad, these are mad. Those are mad shorts. But game five, or well not game five, game one of the Western Conference Finals will be on Saturday. So get Kane, get Kane Laker Nation. Where hopefully we win game one. Actually, we should lose game one. Because Lakers, we haven't won any game ones in the playoffs so far. And guess what? Once we lose the first game of the playoffs, first game one of the playoffs, we win the next four in a row. So maybe the Lakers should do that. But nah, I would rather have a win than a loss. Of course. Especially in playoffs. Because if you lose four times, you go home as we saw with the Clippers. We don't need to bring up much about that. If you want to see me talking about the Clippers, go and watch yesterday's video because that was a video and a half. You do not want to miss me shitting on the Clippers. But the Clippers, what a joke that is. But the Lakers, I hope the Lakers get the job done. It will be a tough challenge. I'm not going to say it's going to be a walk in the park. Each game is going to be a challenge, especially against the Nuggets. Because they have, as I said, they have came back 3-1. They have came back 3-1, not once. But twice this season. In in the playoffs. Would you believe that? 3-1 they came back. 3-1 twice in the playoffs. The only team I'm pretty sure in NBA history to come back twice. That is nuts. Is what I'm going to say. They brought their inner LeBron James twice. But Jesus Christ. They brought, I mean, brought their inner Cleveland Cavaliers. Because it was a team effort. With people hitting shots. But the thing is, we have to work on the defense base for Jokic. Figures with Jokic, 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 Jokic. He plays so slow. He's just like this. Ugh. Like, he's so slow, but he's so skilled. For a guy who runs, he's probably one of the slowest people out on the court. Like, he's slow as. Like, literally, anyone can freaking beat him in the race. He's that slow. But he's so talented and skilled. We gotta keep the Nuggets off the three point line. Nuggets, they are. I kinda get worried, but I still got the Lakers winning five. It might go to six, or who knows? Lakers might just be like, stuff this. We wanna go to the Western Conference. We, no, West. We just wanna go to the NBA Finals. Stuff ya. We'll beat you in four. Sweep ya. So hopefully, it's one of the good results. Hopefully, the Lakers get this good dub. Murray, hopefully you struggle like you did in game two of the regular season when you only had six points. Hopefully you do that. And Jokic, he has, he's, he's only scored 20 points once and that was in the overtime game where they lost. So Jokic does usually score around, probably around 15 points per game, maybe a bit higher. Against the Lakers, and LeBron and AD have scored over like 20 points, 25 points each game. Apart from the game LeBron didn't play, he didn't score anything, of course. You don't get his stats when you don't play. But yeah, this is going to be, this is going to be, a, this is going to be an interesting series. I do have the Lakers, I just keep saying, Lakers and five. I won't be too stressed out. Because I, I'm not really stressed that we're going to lose this series. I'm 100% sure we're going to win this series. We're a different team than the Clippers. The Clippers, they will just more focus about us. They won't focus about the Nuggets. We, us, when it, we don't have to worry about the Clippers anymore. Because we, we, I, everyone thought it was going to be the Lakers v Nuggets. No, Lakers v Clippers. Sorry, freaking I'm stuttering. But, mm. Lakers v Clippers. The Clippers were just thinking, oh, yep. Yeah. We're just going to steam past these Nuggets. This is going to be an easy challenge. And we're going to take on the real challenge in the LA Lakers. Well, Clippers, you're not there. You, you, 
We're focusing too much on us instead of our nuggets. But let's hope the Lakers don't do that. We don't think of going, thinking about just stuff this. The Nuggets are easy challenge. We're going to the playoffs easy. No way you can think of that. No way. If we do that, we're going home. But anyways, hopefully we don't go home. Hopefully we make it to the NBA Finals for the first time in since 2010. I'm pretty sure that's when we last made it to the NBA Finals with Kobe, Pau Gasol, freaking Andrew Bynum was in it. On the lake is Derek Fish, I'm pretty sure. Meta World Peace. There's a lot of people. Freaking that bus guy was like a top three pick. He was really good in college, but then just was shit. He had, like didn't have a shower or whatever. But yeah, this, hopefully we get the championship. But let's get that Western Conference championship first. And yeah, get to the NBA Finals because... Let's go, Lakers. Let's go, because I'm keen. Keen for a good series. Hopefully, it's a short series for us, Lakers. We just get past the Denver Nuggets and makes it to the NBA Finals. Yeah, let's go. Let's go, Laker Nation. I'm going to finish off the video right here. Sorry if I stuttered through it. I did stutter, of course. Freaking I'm speech fast and what, trying to be a rapper, you know. Lakers. Laker Nation, stand up. Come on, stand up. Stand up with me. Stand up. Stand up. Get some Lakers stuff on you. Get some Lakers stuff on you. Because Laker Nation. Lakers. Lakers around the world. We're going to win this. And we're going to the NBA Championship. Let's not think ahead of ourselves, though. I know I'm thinking ahead of ourselves. Let's get this Western Conference Championship. Before we make it to the NBA Finals. Come on, Laker Nation. Stand up with me. Stand up with me. Because we are going to beat the Denver Nuggets in five or four or six games. We're not going to seven. We're not going to be LLA Clippers. If we are up 3-1 against the Denver Nuggets, we are going to make sure we beat the Denver Nuggets. We are going to let them come back. We're going to end the series. We ain't going to do the same mistake as LA Clippers. Because we ain't the chokers. We ain't don't choke the Lakers. We do not choke. I promise you. We are winning this series. We ain't doing no Clipper move. We ain't, if we go up in the series, we are staying up and we are going to that championship. Shit, we're going to the NBA Finals. Come on. Come on, Laker Nation. Stand up. Stand up. Because we are going to beat the Denver Nuggets. Come on. Let's go, Laker Nation. If you're new around here, anyway. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoyed my prediction, hit that like button. See that button down there that has subscribe as well? Hit that subscribe button. And if you see that thumbs up, Hit the thumbs up. Do not dislike it. Just give it the biggest thumbs up of your life. Smash that like button! Smash it! And smash that subscribe button! Because like it, Asian! Wow!